Welcome back to TIG Time. We're here at B-Light Aircraft. And last time we were here, we were welding 4130 chromoly. Good high strength to, to weight ratio. Except this one here is different. This is 6061 aluminum, also very, very lightweight. In fact, this particular fuselage, when you lift it, it's amazingly light. We actually put a scale under it, and it's 21.8 pounds. So we've got some fillet wells that we're going to finish the last couple of wells on this frame, and we're going to show you how to do it. Okay, we got the part set up, we got it clamped down, it's pretty stable, we got the ground clamp in place, uh, still have a pointed tungsten, but you know that's going to change because my machine is now set on AC. Uh, there's a button on there, there's a knob that you can turn for balance, it gives you a little better penetration, and I like to use that function. I'm also using a 4043 filler material, it's about 1 16th in diameter. And this particular material is a square tubing. It's going to be a felt weld. It's also about a 1 16th wall thickness. So that's a pretty close match. So let's get started. Okay, I'm welding on 6061 square tubing. The wall thickness is about 062. I'm using a 9F torch so I can get into this fillet weld here. 1 16th diameter tungsten. I've got a puddle started here and I'm dabbing 1 16th 4043 filler into it. So it doesn't take long to heat this up and just keep a good consistent dab going all the way to the end of the weld. Now after I finish up this weld I'd like to go out to the B-Light hanger and actually show you where this weld goes on the finished product. So let's head out there now. Okay, this is the well that we just made. This is part of the aluminum frame. Uh, this is the B Light aircraft in the near finished conditions. Thank you for watching TIG Time. I'm Mr. TIG.